Hi people and welcome back to Virtual Science Club. So what we're going to look at today is elephant's toothpaste. Now if you've been in my year 7 class you might have already seen this. Um, but we're just going to do it in a funnel today. So you watched um, Miss Taylor do her little mini volcano, um, which you could do at home. This one tends to be more um, that you would do in, a, in school, in a science lab. So I've already got some hydrogen peroxide in there, as you can see. Um, I'm going to add some um, fairy liquid so we can get our bubbles and our foam. And then just to make it, give it a colour, I'm going to put some um, blue, we've gone for blue and we're going to put some blue food colouring in as well just hopefully so that we can get a good a good explosion, a nice blue one and we'll see, so I'm just going to be quite generous with that put that in there and then I'm going to put some potassium iodide but as soon as I put this in the reaction will start to, to develop so again we've been looking at reactions and we've been asking you to look at your watch the observations um, and see what you can see so let's go for this then, see if it'll shoot up, I hope so. There we go. Well, it was blue. <laughs> and that's elephant's toothpaste, people. Oh! It's gone a little bit too far. A bit too generous, a bit too generous. <laughs> so just to continue with this, you'll have noticed that there was a gas coming off. That gas was hydrogen. Um, and if we were testing for hydrogen, we would put in a, a lit splint into a test tube with hydrogen gas in and it would pop. I'm going to quickly show you um, a test for oxygen because in these bubbles, um, there's quite a lot of oxygen. So what we do is we light a splint and then what I'll do is I'll blow it out so it's just glowing and hopefully if it works it will relight as magic. <laughs> 